Welcome to my review of Flicky Air, where I'll walk you through some of its standout features, give you a live demo, discuss its pros and cons, and help you decide if Flicky is worth your time. The best part, you can start using it for free. Make sure to subscribe to the channel to receive my latest tutorials, as there are many more amazing AI features we need to explore. First, create a free account. I've placed the link in the description for you. You can sign up with Google, Apple, or your email. I'll choose Google. When you log into the website, you will see this is the interface of Flicky. One thing I believe you'll really enjoy about Flicky is its sheer simplicity. Whenever you want to create something new, be it a video, file, or anything else, just hit the new file button. You can work with videos or create audio content like voiceovers, audiobooks, and podcasts. Plus, you can generate images, slideshows, PDFs, presentations, and more. I personally think the video creation feature is what will attract most users, so let's focus on that. We'll start with a basic idea, turning it into a video using a specific prompt. You can also convert scripts, blogs, PowerPoints, tweets, and products into videos using customizable templates. So let's say we want to do a very quick video about safe ways to lose weight. I will use the idea to create a video. I click on idea, then I paste my prompt into it. We, we can adjust the maximum duration as needed. If you use the free version, your video will be limited to one minute. If you want a longer video, you will need to upgrade. Then I click on next. You can adjust the aspect ratio if needed, but for this, we'll stick with the portrait mode. Next, you select the language for the video. You can choose English or any other language. Stock media can be in video or image form. With iGenerated Media, you also have the option of using videos or images. If you choose video, you will need to upgrade your account to the paid version. For this example, I'll stick with images. There are many types of images for you to choose from. Pick one that you like. Now we're looking at templates, which I believe is an area where Flicky could improve. Currently, there are 16 templates available, and I think they could expand this selection. To use these templates, you also need to upgrade to a paid account, but let's keep going. You can use AI avatars and also branding and other customization options, but these features are for paid accounts. But let's keep it simple, then I click on Submit. Okay, so here we are on the Flicky's dashboard. The interface is super clean, straightforward, and incredibly user-friendly. All of these are big wins for me. First, let's focus on the audio. Click here and you can edit the volume, speed, fade in, fade out, and duration of it. I'll click here and mute the background music so that you can clearly hear what's playing and it won't interfere when I'm talking over it. You can also upload your own audio file by clicking here. One thing I really like about Flicky is how it handles voiceovers. You'll notice that the text on screen adapts to the tone of the voiceover, which is a unique feature compared to many other video AI and editing tools. Typically, the text on screen just mirrors what the voiceover says, but Flicky sometimes shortens or even adds to it. It's a small, thoughtful detail that I really appreciate. Let me play the video so we can watch a bit of it together, and you can get a sense of how it works. Just a heads up, the audio is playing through my speakers, so if it doesn't sound flawless, that's why. Now here's the video. Have you ever wondered why some people can eat whatever they want and stay slim? It's not just genetics. The secret lies in their daily habits. First, they prioritize protein-rich foods that keep them feeling full. They also practice mindful eating, savoring each bite. So after a quick review, most of it looks pretty good. The voiceover sounds decent too, but we can adjust it if necessary. I'm just skimming through to make sure there's nothing too unusual. So, there's a bunch of images here. If we want to change anything, we just need to go to the media section. You'll have the option to switch between videos or images. Let's say we want to replace it with a video. Let's search for lose weight. You will see that there are many videos with similar content. Choose one that you like. This one looks great. Let's go ahead and use this one. Obviously, it's not going to play right now, but this gives you a much clearer example. Changing the media is really simple. Just click on the element you want to replace. If you decide to choose this media, then click on Select, and you will see this media appear in your video. Now, we can also modify the voiceover to say something different, and naturally, the text can be updated too. You'll have plenty of customization options like font alignment, background color, 
text color, animations and transitions to make everything fit your style. If you've worked with any video editing tools before, most of this will feel pretty familiar. Naturally, we can also change the voiceover if we want to give it a different sound. Just click on Mia. You'll have access to both standard voices and ultra-realistic ones to choose from. You can apply it to a single scene or to the entire video if you prefer consistency throughout. Once you have chosen the voiceover you like, make sure to click Select. Finally, when you're ready to download, the Download button is right here, making it easy to share on all your social media platforms. If you're using the free version, you can only download at 720p resolution and in MP4 format. If you want to download higher quality videos without a watermark, you need to upgrade to a paid account. Let's go back and try another example, this time with a different type of eye-generated video. For this next example, we'll create a video titled Basketball Tips for Beginners. This time, I will create a video from a script. I'll ask ChatGPT to write the script. I'll copy this script and paste it into the script box, then click on Summarize to shorten it, then click Next. This time we're going with a landscape format. Now we can explore a few more templates. These ones use the 16 to 9 aspect ratio as you can see. Please choose a template that you like, hit Submit, and we'll have the results in just a few seconds. Alright, here we are with the shortened version, just 57 seconds, compared to the full-length script we started with. Looking it over. Start dribbling with both hands using fingertips, not your palm. Keep your head up for better chord awareness. This one's pretty good, but if you don't like any media, you can change it by clicking on Media, typing in the keyword Basketball, and searching for the media clip you like. The last step was choosing your favorite music, right? So let's keep that. We'll dive back into the example, and once again, I've reduced the background music volume to make everything clearer. Let's get that perfect footage rolling. Start dribbling with both hands using fingertips, not your palm. Keep your head up for better chord awareness. Learn shooting basics. Square your body. Wow, this looks great. I think it turned out fantastic. We had a few clips that needed adjustments but overall, everything came together seamlessly. If you want to replace the music with something else, you can definitely do so by clicking here and searching for the music you like. You can also use sound effects in your video. In this guide, I only selected images to create the video. If you choose to use short video clips to make the video, you'll find it much more dynamic. Overall, I am satisfied with the videos created by Flicky, so I wanted to briefly highlight Flicky AI's pricing options. You can start with the free version, but remember, you only get 5 minutes of credits per month. Just enough to make one or two videos and see how it works. From there, you can upgrade to one of the paid plans. With the standard plan you get 100 at a minutes of credits each month. You'll have access to over 1000 voices including 150 ultra-realistic ones in 5 languages, Full HD videos up to 15 minutes, millions of premium assets like images, video clips, stickers, and more. Plus, important perks like no watermarks and commercial rights. If you want to go premium, that's where you get AI avatars, video cloning, and even more features. To sum it up, Flicky AI is an easy-to-use platform that provides a robust set of tools from text to video to idea to video and much more. While I haven't had the chance to test everything, like the AI avatars, it's on the premium plan, the essential features work really well, and the video quality is impressive. Of course, you might have to adjust some media here and there, which is typical for any video editor, but overall, Flicky AI performed solidly. I'd like to see more template options and stock footage available, but even as it stands, Flicky's offerings are very strong. I highly recommend giving it a try if you're interested. The pros really outweigh the cons, which brings my Flicky AI review to a close. Don't forget, you can start for free using the link in the description, I'm Jack. And thank you so much for watching this review. I'll catch you in my next video.